Here I am with uh, Magic... Uh, Magic Ballet. Yeah, What's Magic happening? Ballet. Hey, before we do anything, let me show you something cool. So I'm glad you watched the TV show Close Up Kings, but this is going to happen right on camera. So watch this. I'm going to use a deck of cards, okay? If you notice, all the cards are completely different. They're all completely different, right? Every single one. I'm going to go through the cards like this. Go ahead and just say stop. Stop. Stop right there. Memorize that card. You got it? As a matter of fact, we'll leave it sticking out. There it is. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make an exact replica of this card, okay? So the first thing I got to do is use my red card. I'm going to get the color to match. Blue. Watch really close. Blue. Not only is it blue, but it's the exact replica of the card that you stopped on. That, my friends, is real magic. Pretty good, right? So listen, a uh, little bit of tip. A little tip if you're going to be learning magic. Uh, you have to, don't, don't ever feel like you're not doing it right. If, if, you, if you're struggling with a trick, one of my best little tips is stop doing it for a little while, pick it up later, but never stop practicing and never perform a trick when you, until you're 100% sure you can do it. Underwater, upside down, backwards. Make sure that you can do it perfectly before you go out and do it. Have confidence, be funny, because the first thing in magic is you have to entertain, you have to be an entertainer. So use a little bit of comedy if you like, but listen to me, uh, take it as far as you can. Magic is a good thing. You can really get far with magic. Even if you don't become a professional magician, you can use it to your advantage. Trust me. And one Thank more you. thing. It works with the ladies. <laughs> I gotta go. Thank you. <laughs>